It looks like the non-alcoholic Liquid Motion Club will be opening this week, and for now until 3 a.m. Dan Gaffney followed tonight's standing room only city commission meeting where a decision was or rather wasn't made. Dan? Kirsten, this was just the first hearing on a proposed ordinance that would regulate when alcohol-free dance clubs would close. Liquid Motion is one such club, and although they have yet to open, they say the ordinance is aimed specifically at them. Chief Chris, Ma Chris Magnus says the ordinance came about because several people expressed interest in opening, in opening similar juice bars. We merely ask that we take a proactive approach now so we don't have to take a reactive approach later. There were just a few people in support of the ordinance. Dave Anderson of the Downtown Community Partnership says a 1 a.m. closing time will keep people from bars serving alcohol going into a liquor-free dance club. That will help us to, uh, to avoid a particular mixing of, of, of those particular clientele uh, after the hour of 1 o'clock. Attorney William Kirshner spoke for the owners of Liquid Motion, saying the ordinance presumes they can't run their business legally. We don't think we've got to give them a license. We've got to uh, threaten them with revocation because they're not going to comply. After Kirshner answered questions from the commission, there were more than a dozen people who spoke to city commissioners saying that young people don't work nine to five jobs and need places like liquid motion. Most of us go to school all day long, then we have to go work some menial job until the hours of the night being your servers, waiters, and you know, ticket holders at movie theaters. When the city of Fargo flooded, as Dave said, Thousands of college students had no problem saving a community that half of them weren't even from. Now they're asking to stay out till whatever time they so choose, and the city has a problem with it. This is not right. I mean, even with this dance club, I get off work at 2, 2.30 in the morning. If this closes at 1, how am I supposed to? I work full time. Where am I supposed to go to have fun? <laughs> Now, Liquid Motion did have a liquor license that would have required them to close at 1 a.m., but their landlord got rid of it. Liquid Mo Motion will now open Thursday, and they will be able to stay open until 3 a.m. So for the next two weeks until the next city commission meeting, we don't really know what's going to happen. Kirsten? Okay, Dan, thank you very much. Students on the